Um, these are the conditions for the first match here. Seven overs aside, so a two over power play. Two bowlers, way bowl two overs. Everyone else restricted to just the single. But let's get on the field now as we see the Czech women coming out to field. Be the first ball of this ECI W. And it's a pretty good ball, actually. It's Fawa Barbera who is going to get us going. We've got a bit of indecision in the end. They won't take a run. Oh, bold. Really well bold. It's an in swing up. And Nezovic is going to go for a duck on her ECI debut. But you've got to hand it to the bowl there, Fawa. Really got that one to talk. It was in through the gate, and we have our first wicket, and it's two for one. Yeah, this is well bowled. Just floats it up there. The wicket, the wicket. Look at the, the follow through there. Absolutely perfect. Head nice and still. Good action. Trader, which she does. It's in the air, catching opportunity, but it's not held. And so Anisic gets her first run of the series, but uh, Yasna, a little bit lucky to survive that one. Yeah, that was um, Munsee. In the air, and what a good catch that is by Delante Ionetti. He had to make some ground here. Not easy conditions underfoot, but she takes the return chance. And so Croatia lose the second wicket, 19 for two. What a good piece of fielding. Excellent work this is. It really is. I mean, he, she is the only person going to get to that was the bowler herself, and she did superbly well. Then Ionetti. Excellent. Just watch this again. So she's bowled it. There's a, a bit of a slice on this. And that ball is spinning as well. And she's onto it straight away. Really good sharp catch. And remember, she's taken this with a very soft ground. You saw there. And this one, well, it would have been a wide, but it gets played at. And it says spores are wide there. There's a rip. I think that, oh, the game for two. So well, that's really that good is heads really up. good running. Good awareness there. I thought for a moment maybe she was happy to take the single. I really want the push on here. And that's a nice looking shot. we looking to double up. She wants to go back and strike. She drops a bat, but she has time to pick it up and get back. So it might even be. No, she was thinking about the third. They make good decisions. This is a nice shot, though. Again, should be pushing for two here. I think they'll get it fairly easily. It's about as close as we've come to seeing a ball reach the rope. And again, Senyuk does a good job to hustle back to the non strikers in. Watching Erin out there. She goes right across, and that's not a bad delivery. Got a hustle here. Got, got to come back. Got a good eye to play that away. She was right in front of the stumps. Yeah. She'll get another two. She really took a big risk there, uh, stepping across the stumps. But like I said, Kalamala to deliver the last ball. And it's up in the air. It's a catching opportunity. It goes down. And now they're going to settle for the one in the end. So, well, it's bang on that 35 we were talking about. Yeah. 35 for two off the seven. And, yeah, again, you see there, if they had come back for a second, they probably would have got it. So I think that these just little things, I mean, uh, the value of a single run in a low-scoring game is a bit more yeah. precious. And, and so that's why, yeah, look, take nothing away from Vukasic, though. She bats through the innings for 20 and had some support. And Senyuk doesn't score too many against her name, but I think she did run very well. going to have Katarina Tesarikova first up. The first one's down the leg side for a wide. Oh and they'll God, run God, an extra. Stop it. Stop it. So well, maybe more than an extra. They'll come back oh for God. two. So it'll be three wides to get us going. Really sound to here, Mr. Maximo. Long it's firmly hit. And it's a chance. And it's going to be close here. The dive comes in. And is the bat down? Is it not? Well, I don't know. But i got to say, this is why... I mean... I've got to say, I kind of put this on Nan Devada, who didn't want the run. Let's have a look. Well, wow, this could be an interesting replay. What's happened here? It's foggy. <laughs> I think she might be. Oh, I think she's just out. But, yeah, I've got to say, you <laughs> that's if they can see it. Hit pretty well. And, well, with the dive, you might as well get your running boots on. We might even see a three here, potentially. And Ivada's back for a couple. I think they'll settle for that in the end. That was a, a cracking shot off the back foot. 
as this is pulled away nicely. And they'll go on the hit and they'll get one. I'd be coaching saying, girls, I want at least three runouts this innings. And I'd be talking to the batting side saying that. Yeah. That's better for Lydia. That's nicely bowled. And uh, she'll be looking for two here. In fact, this one is going to be a teaser. Oh, that's a great bit of fielding. We almost saw a boundary there. What a great stop that is from Christina. And I get the feeling that with these runs here, that probably concludes the contest. With the two runs, the umpires are just checking. As we have a look at this great bit of fielding, look, that ball is just... I thought it was going to have the legs. It doesn't. It is a victory then for Czechia. As the Czechia players come onto the field of play to congratulate the two batters out there. And uh, that's what I like there. Look, I'm liking the fact that even the Croatian players are celebrating. Because it's a, it's a magical moment for both sets of players. So check it, yeah, don't do your celebrations there say. because <laughs> it could be a bit, a bit dicey. Here we go. Yeah, enjoy the moment.